My name is Albert Flores. I'm I'm your student nurse for today. So I, I'm from Pinalong, Pamantasan, and let's go to Montina. So the procedure, what I'm going to do is the subcutaneous injection for intramuscular. Okay. So first, I'm going to verify the doctor's orders for my patient, and I'm going to provide privacy for. And also, I'm going to explain what I'm going to do and what why it's necessary. So then, I'm going to um do the hand hygiene or hand washing because we need to prevent cross contamination and I need um wash my hand in 30 seconds with soap and water and and dry it in an easy way okay the next is I'm going to prepare all the materials what we need I'm I'm using insulin a uh, 1cc insulin syringe alcohol cotton pads ghost pad gloves and sterile water in the medication cart and in the medication tray and the MAR for the patient or the medical administration record. So the next procedure is I'm going to um, read the MAR on the medication record for my patient to base the um, medication from a um, insulin syringe. So we need to base on the um, medical record for the patient to use the medic um, medication for the measurement of the insulin syringe. Okay, so I'm using one cc. So the medical record is the tens of using the um in the record of the medication record. Okay. So first, I'm going to um, wear gloves. So I'm going to wear gloves. Wearing glove is preventing cross contamination and also infections to the skin of the patient while we inject the insulin syringe. So, hi ma'am. Um, how are you? I'm okay. Okay. So, is it okay? I'm injecting and using an um, insulin syringe with you. Okay. okay, so this is a um, bite of ants, just like bite of ants or just So I'm done um, wearing um, gloves. So next procedure is I'm going to use cotton balls and alcohol um, using circling, circulation motion in the skin of the patient. Why in the in the in the, in the muscle of the patient? So the injection of the injection for insulin syringe is in the fats of the patient in the fats of the mass of the patient in between so this is the alcohol and okay so the next is we need to open this so i'm using a uh, insulin syringe so, and get, and so I'm using a zero, um, it depends the, um, medical records measurement so so this one
So I'm using a 45 degrees for the injection of the patient. So I'm using a ghost pad. I'm using a ghost pad for the wipe for the um, lessen the pain of the injection of the patient. Okay. So so the next procedure is I'm going to um um dispose all the materials that I needed I needed and also um, documents all the information what we needed and again we do the proper hand hygiene and to prevent constant contamination. Again my name is Alba Flores. I'm your student as for the I'm nurse for today so I'm from Pemba Pamantas and I'm a student. Thank you.